dun 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 Wow, you're hard to you're hard to find. Not if you follow the gorilla path. Anyway, what's up? I'm a reporter and I would like to ask you a few questions for an interview. Okay then. Shoot. Where were you born? I was born in San Francisco, California in nineteen thirty two. What was your childhood like? When I was a girl, my parents got divorced, so I grew up with my mother and my stepfather. Where did you find your inspiration? On summer vacation, after my first year of college, I found work on a dude ranch. In return, they let me stay with them since they were in Kentucky and my home was in California. But then I was forced to leave because I got the chicken pox. Years after college, Professor Leakey came to me. He told me about Jane Goodall, and he said he wanted me to study gorillas, so I did. What was the first encounter with gorillas like? Leakey sent me to a <coughs> on a trip to the mountains in Uganda. It was a magical experience. They were mixed of all emotions, mostly uh, depression and happiness. Once I spend more and more time with them, they get more and more excited to see me. Yep. How long did you stay with the gorillas? I stayed with them for about seven years. I'd like I'd rather stay with them more than I'd like to live in the city. So why w why would you pick the city over the gorilla well why would you pick the gorillas over the city? They keep better company, and they don't argue as much as humans. Interesting. So, you just sit out here the whole time and just play with the gorillas? Yep, I play them, study, I study their behaviors, and basically just things like that. Alright, you get you. Alright, here's the next question for you. Okay? Okay. Um, how did your college go? Uh, first, I went to the University of Kentucky. Then I went to the Dude Ranch over the summer. And then once I, <clears throat> once the next year of college started, I went back to California. And I went to the University of California and changed my focus to the pre-veterinarian student. Uh, after a little while, I figured out that the science was too hard for me. So I changed my, so I changed my major to an occupational therapist. Then, about seven years later, that's when Leakey came out and uh, offered me to work with the gorillas. So this 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 Leakey professor, why why did he pick you? He you knew I really loved working with animals, and he saw that we that me and Jane Goodall had both similar interests. And she did really good with the chimpanzees, so he figured that I would do good with the gorillas. Interesting. So, what kind of tests did you do with the gorillas? Like, what did you do out there with them? Uh, like, as far as tests go, like, I basically just let them be who they were. And I didn't do any, like, written tests or anything for them. And I basically just studied, like, their everyday things that they went through. Like, how they moved around. So. Very, very intelligent answer. That was some Disney stuff right there. And uh, one, one last question to ask you. Okay. What is, what are the main diet of the chimpanzees? You mean gorillas? Yeah. Well, mostly like they just see like the plants and uh, berries and stuff around them. But, like sometimes they. Uh, like for territorial reasons, like they would attack other gorillas or other apes, and then sometimes they would even steal the young, and they go cannibal. So what you're telling me is they eat their own kind sometimes, but mostly it's just the plants and berries. So wait, wait. So why didn't they eat you? Because I didn't end up as a threat. Did you like give them bananas or something? Or? Uh, nope. When I came up, 
to them. I just came up nice and slow and showed that I wasn't a threat to them. I just stayed low to the ground to show that they were dominant over me. And then I just didn't harm their young or didn't try to do anything to threaten their group. Alright, that, that's all we have time for my questions, so... I'll leave you alone with your EP friends, and, uh... Thank you. You're welcome. Proud to be a help for you. Goodbye. Bye. Do -do 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 -do. Ah! <laughs>